Hi there. Welcome to everyone who's joined us today. We appreciate you taking time out of your busy day to sit in on our webinar. My name is Lori Woodbury and I am a business development manager here with, at South and I've got David Mitchell, our client development specialist with us and he will also be speaking during this time. Hi there. The purpose of this webinar is to give you a better understanding of selling in the political market and therefore help you increase your sales of political products. During this webinar, you should gain some tips on how to find the customers and learn what marketing tools can help you land the orders. I've broken the webinar into four parts and those are listed on your screen. I expect it to take about 20 to 30 minutes. During the webinar, if you have any questions, just type them in the chat section on the right side of your screen, and then we'll take time to answer them at the end of the presentation. So let's go ahead and get started. At Stiles, we say we're a trade-only supplier, also known as a printer's printer. We sell only for qualified distributors of our product and do not work with end users. Stiles is located in New Century, Kansas, just south of Kansas City. And our business, just like our city, has a small town personalized feel. We have around 325 employees. Many have worked at Stouse for over 10 years. We all know each other's names and enjoy working together towards the greater good, your success. <clears throat> Stouse continually receives high ratings for our customer service and high quality product. A testament to the 325 people who come together to make this happen every day. This is a list of the most commonly ordered products at Stouse. However, this is not all we do. About 30% of our orders are custom, which means they are not listed in our catalog. This is a good point to keep in mind. Just because you don't see it in the catalog doesn't mean we can't do it. At Stouse, we feel we should be always be your starting point for any print order. When you get an obscure request from a customer, rather than spending your valuable time trying to figure out how, call Stouse and let us take care of it for you. Part one, election by the numbers. When you think political market, oftentimes, especially right now, our thoughts go to the major national campaigns. While those are great campaigns to get involved with from a business standpoint, getting in the door is tough and there is not enough candidates to keep every distributor busy, although this presidential election was pretty close. When you think political market, you need to be thinking on a local and state level. There are far more local and state elections every year and those election cycles often occur with more frequency than national elections. In 2016, there are over 2,600 predicted elections with 1,800 of those at the local level. Local ballot measures will even add to that total. Opportunity is everywhere. There are many different types of elections and each election has candidates or a cause. The national elections drag on forever and present many opportunities for promotional materials. The smaller elections may not be as lengthy but still offer opportunities for you to get involved. One small local election can generate big business for printers. And I'll interrupt here real quick and just give you an example. Um, in our local 2015 school board election, there were four seats up for election. Position one had two candidates running. Positions two and three each had an unopposed candidate running. And position four had four candidates who filed. Because there were more than three candidates running for position four, they had to hold a primary election. And then the final two candidates from that advanced to the general election. So in this one school district, there were eight opportunities for campaign materials. There are six school districts in our county, so you can start to see how that adds up and that opportunity really is everywhere. And there's more than enough to go around. It is projected that 20% more to be spent on a political advertising in 2016 than the last presidential election in 2012. This all spells out positive news for you. Hopefully by now we've caught your attention and you're thinking that selling in this market might not be such a bad idea after all. Part two, where are the candidates? So where are the candidates? The first and probably most obvious place is the internet. There are hundreds, even thousands of political websites to check out. Here I've listed a few that I think will helpful when trying to find a candidate information. The names of the political candidates and their contact information are matters of public record. Bounce around the internet and you should be able to find what you need with a little effort. 
the local election office. Your local election office will also have a listing of candidates for federal, state, county, and city offices. Other great places to visit to, at the local offices from various political parties. Representatives at these locations know the answers on how to reach the candidates and will be happy to let you know about fundraising events, meetings, or other networking opportunities. These are a great place to meet the decision makers and the campaigns. Oftentimes those are the people you want to know, not even the can even more so than the candidate. So part three, what are they buying? Popular political products include bumper stickers, posters, corrugated signs, banners, lapel stickers, rally fans, and the list goes on. We produce almost everything on this page except for the bottom three options, the pins, buttons, t-shirts, and hats. Um, but our top four political products are bumper stickers, posters, corrugated signs, and magnets. So I'm going to break each one of those down for you and just talk a little bit more about each, uh, each thing. Bumper stickers are supplied on our white vinyl material, which is the most frequently ordered material at Stouts. Our white vinyl can be screen printed or digitally printed, and both of those use outdoor durable inks. Backsheet imprints are available as well, which is a great way for your candidate to convey an additional message or advertise a sponsorship. For example, the candidate could have a rally sponsored by a business. That business can buy the bumper stickers and advertise their business on the back of the sticker. The candidate gets his message out for free and the business gets added publicity, so it's a win-win situation. We have three different types of posters. Our fold-over poster is shipped to you flat, allowing you to staple the signs once they arrive. Our pre-stapled posters come already stapled and frames are included in the price. And then our newest poster, which will be in our 2016 catalog, the glued poster, it ships with the sides already glued and it has a really seamless appearance and provides easy setup. These posters can be produced using spot colors or four color process and they're commonly used for local and regional campaigns. Corrugated signs are the bulk of all sign orders at Stouts. The reasons for this are cost, durability, and range of sizes. This material is extremely durable and has an average outdoor life expectancy of one year. We can screen print or digitally print on this material, and you can also print different images on either side with no extra charge. Magnets are a great handout for your candidates as well. Some ideas are business card magnets, calendar magnets, picture frame magnets, and save the date magnets that they can use to remind their constituents of when to get out and vote. They may also be interested in our outdoor magnets. Those make a, a nice alternative to our bumper stickers. And then we also offer car door magnets so your candidate could advertise their, their candidacy around town. So what is the purpose of these products? The products are handed out to supporters at rallies, parades, dinners, or they can be sent out as part of direct mail campaigns. And increasingly, we're seeing that these products are being sold as a way to raise money to pay for all the television, radio, and direct mail costs that the candidates incur. Some of these products are also being used as thank yous to donors who've contributed to their campaign. So we've talked about the opportunity that's available in the political market, where to find the candidates, and what products they might buy. Now we need to discuss the tools that we have available to help you sell. Here we have a list of Stouts products to help you sell in this market. But keep in mind, this list can be translated to almost any market that you are trying to get into, so that is good to note. We offer a full line catalog. Um, our 2016 catalog will be coming out soon, should be the first of the year. And then we also have a digital version of our full line catalog that could be branded with your company logo. Let us know if this is something that you're interested in and we can send that to you after the webinar. As for samples, we do have a political sample pack. I truly believe that samples make a huge impact. When the customer can see the product in person, you really grab their attention and you just get one step closer to closing the sale. You can request sample kits either online or you can email orders at stouts.com. 
We also have a political sample box, and that's not offered on our website, but it's going to be sent to each of you who attended our webinar today. This box has a full-size corrugated sign, sample-size banners, hand signs, bumper stickers, and roll labels. The box is unbranded, and it contains products for a generic candidate. So, you know, we think it would make a great presentation for any of your customers interested in political products. Oh, and Lori, don't forget to mention that we also have a smaller political brochure, which is great for your customers, but also a useful tool for you to use when you're trying to upsell. For example, take the political customer who comes in for just one banner, suggest lapel stickers, rally fans, or water bottle labels as additional branding tools. Our political brochure is also available digitally and is attached as a handout to this webinar. That's a good point, David. Um, you guys should be able to see that again on the right side of your screen. There's a section called Handouts, and if you just expand that, our political brochure is attached as a PDF. All right, um, our sales sheets can be found on our website, and they are available for almost any market that you can think of. We do have three sales sheets for political products only, but then we have over 20 others that could be used in this market, and total on our website we have 70 or 80 sheets. The sheets are customizable with your information, and they're great for handouts at a customer visit or as invoice stuffers. So, for example, when you email or you mail the invoice to that customer who bought the political banner, you can attach a personalized sales sheet so they can see what else you can do for them. Ideas that sell videos and blog articles. All of these tools are available on our website as well, and all are for you to use as educational tools for yourself as well as your customers. We design these for you to use really as you wish. So if you think we have a great blog post, by all means, copy and paste it to your blog and then use it as your own. Our focus is really to help you sell more of our products to your customers. It helps your bottom line as well as ours. All of the art from our catalog is also available on our website for your use, which means you have over 10,000 images available to you for free. You could use this art to create your own flyers or to show products on your website. And every product in our catalog has an available online template. This is useful for both you and your customers. Um, the templates are easily accessed from our website. You just type a T for template in front of the item number in the search box on our website, and then you'll be directed to a link for an EPS or a PDF version of that template. The, as you can see on the screen here, the bleed lines and the cut margin are shown, which helps with art setup. And you know, if you use our template, you really your art should be good to go once you send it in. After this presentation, I'll take you to our website for a quick demo on where to find all of these sales tools. And last, but definitely not least, our customer service department is our most valuable tool. When you call Staus, more than likely you will speak with one of our 35 customer service representatives. We pride ourselves on the fact that you will not ever reach an automated system. We have live operators and will guarantee that you can speak to a customer service rep, which means no voicemail. Our customer service reps are highly trained and they work diligently to get you what you need. They are your resource for all things Staus, and in turn, they really do represent you and your best interests. Um, just as a side note, our customer service reps do have three weeks of intense training before they ever get near a phone. We like to make sure that they are well trained to answer most of the questions that you may ask. So some points to remember here are that selling in this space is extremely competitive. You really have to seek out the candidates, and it's a good idea to have a plan before you meet with them. You need to find out what's important to your candidate. Pricing and turnaround times are high on every customer's list, but one may weigh, outweigh the other. You should probably find out what that is so that you know before you start getting your bids. If your candidate does have a hot button, whether it be pricing or production time, those are definitely the two most common, then it's good to let your supplier know up front so that they can be prepared from the quoting process on. And while we understand you have your choice of suppliers, keep in mind that Stouse has been doing political work for years. 
we understand that candidates are demanding and we understand that it's our job to make you look good, so we do our best to make that happen. At SAUS, we realize that when we, you succeed, so do we. We want you to utilize all that we have to offer to help you succeed and grow your business, and I hope that today we've provided you some additional information to help you do that. We conduct webinars two Wednesdays each month, uh, so if you found today's information useful, you can you know, start uh, putting those on your calendar. The first Wednesday of every month is our Getting to Know Staff webinar. And then the third Wednesday of every month is an informative, in-depth webinar like this one on a variety of topics. And um, you can see up there that our next webinar will be Wednesday, January 21st. And that one's going to cover our online ordering system. Just a note on that, I truly believe that if you are placing a catalog order, that our online ordering system is the best way to place that order. So if you're not familiar with that, this is one you would definitely want to tune into. You can visit our website to sign up for future webinars, and we also will send out emails to inviting you to sign up for those. So thank you to all of us who joined us today. I'm going to quickly hop to our website to demonstrate some of the sales tools that we talked about. I've recorded this webinar and we'll email the recorded version to you if you want to review any of the topics that we covered or share it with anybody else in your office. I'll also be sending all of you our political sample kit as well as the large political box that I mentioned. And please let myself or David or our customer service reps know if you all have any questions or needs. So hang on just a second while I get over to our website. Okay, so when you get to the website, you definitely want to be logged in. And if you don't know your login, which is your account number and your password, then you can call and customer or email and somebody in customer service can help you with that information. The first thing I wanted to show you is our sales sheets, and those can be found in our media library. Just click on that and it's going to take you to the sales sheet option here. You can see that they are divided up by um, industry or market segments and then also by product, which should make it easier for you to search what you, for what you need. Since we are talking politics, I'm going to click on the political segment. And then I'll scroll down to find those. Uh, yeah, here's the three political specific brochures. If you open up one of those, then it's going to give you the opportunity to customize it with your company name, sales rep, and you can even go down here and put phone number and email address. And just to show you, when you type in these fields, um, you can type and then you get all the way to the end and then the text just starts getting smaller. So you can really put quite a bit of information in that space. The next thing I wanted to show you is our ideas that sell, and that is also on the same sales sheets page. It's just down here at the bottom. So click there, and it's going to take you to some ideas that sell for a variety of products or markets. Again, since we're discussing politics, let's click on that one. And this is just more of like an in-depth analysis of how to sell a pol political product. Um, you know, you could do it for discount cards or bumper stickers. I think this is really useful information. The next thing I wanted to show you is our videos, and those, again, are found in our media library. Click on that, and they're organized uh, the same way as our sales sheets are, by industry and market or by product. So we'll click here, and it's going to show you a variety of options for videos that you can watch. Um, you know, when I think these are useful is to give you some sales techniques and then you know we've got videos to watch on like how to apply our cut vinyl decals which is a frequently asked question that we get and we've got videos on the best way to hang our banners so there's some useful information in here I also wanted to show you our blog this can be accessed from any page on our website just click on the B and it's going to take you to our blog and like I said, use this information how, as your own if you want. Um, you know, if you think it's something your customers would be interested in, copy, paste, post it to yours, and um, call it a day. The last thing I wanted to show you was how to search for a template. So here's our search box, and you just enter T for template, and then the item number right there. And you can see that it's going to take you to that EPS or PDF version. 
open it up and there you go. You know exactly how to set up your art, so it's nice and easy. So that concludes the webinar portion of this. I'm now going to open this up for some questions. It looks like we have a few and I will we will answer those here. So it looks like the first question is that they've heard that getting paid on political orders is difficult. Any suggestions? Um, you know, I have heard that as well. And my best suggestion is to try to get paid up front for the orders to combat the issue. Um, I don't really see any other way around it. I mean, definitely as candidates get into the uh, as they get in and out of the race, you, they, it's going to be harder to collect money from them. So if you can get it up front, I think that's best. I also think that the campaigns are used to that request. So if you do ask for it up front, it probably won't catch them off guard. Um, this next question asks what our standard lead times are. Um, that's a little more difficult to answer because it's really dependent. But if, if you order catalog quantities, then usually it's probably six working days depending on the item. If it's higher than catalog, then production time depends. But if you have an enhanced date, you know, if your customer has said they need their bumper stickers by a certain date, then just let us know and we will do our very best to meet that with either all of the order or even part of the order to get them by until we can complete the whole thing. But those enhanced dates are definitely Definitely good information to convey to us. Um, I don't know that I see any more questions here, but I, uh, I do. We do have a brief questionnaire at the end of the webinar. I think if it works, um, it should take less than a minute, and we would really appreciate any feedback you can give to us just to help us improve as we continue to do these webinars. So thank you again for attending. We do appreciate your time. Best of luck selling in the political market. And we wish all of you a happy holidays. Thank you. Thank you very much.